Hello folks, breaking my boxes very early today. Well, the story is I've actually gone right down to the USPS warehouse personally to collect my parcel today. Didn't want to run the risk of having this uh, package being delivered to my doorstep in the evening time because I have engagements in the evening later on after out of the house. So I thought, what the heck, I'll just make arrangements for self-collection at the UPS warehouse and the whole process was pretty smooth was in and out of the building within 15 minutes all right first opening today is tops museum champions league had a few uh, good hits in my last two boxes let's hope the good run continues but of course new additions to the autograph collections always welcome whether big time or small time players looking forward to getting some new base cards because uh, in my last two boxes though the autograph hits were pretty nice but the base cards were generally uh, duplicates of what i've already gotten let's hope that is not the case for this box one pack only should be two autographs and a memorabilia card along with a numbered base and about three to four base cards All right, and already I can see a new base card hit. But before that, let's show the, ooh, okay. So I'm getting both the base and the numbered parallel version of uh, James Rodriguez in Bayern Munich colors. Of course, he's on a two season loan at Bayern Munich from Real Madrid. All right, there you go. Good start. So let's do a slow review of the cards one by one. Next up is Kevin Boer of FC Basel. FC Basel now not doing so well in the Swiss Super League. Their status as the top dog in the Swiss Super League has been usurped by, you know, the young boys. So I guess we're not going to see them in the Champions League this season as well as next season. Next up, Alvaro Morata. Chelsea base and then Pepe base in Basictas colors first autograph hit coming up is a pretty nice insert autograph unfortunately this is a repeat autograph I've gotten him in a previous box already and it's Edison 25 of 75 The next hit to come is also a little disappointing because again, I've gotten him before. Although not from Tops or Panini products, I've gotten him in person. So this is actually my first autograph hit of this player, whether from Tops or Panini. I'll show you later who that player is, but let's just uh, talk a little this card first. It's an insert autograph. It belongs to the uh, Road to Kiev insert set. Next autograph hit is Kyle Walker. Got him before in person when he was with Tottenham Hotspur back in 2013 for the Barclays Asia Trophy. So this is the jersey autograph, 95 of 99. This will be one for my Instagram project whereby I'll be comparing his in-person autograph with his uh, commercially signed autograph. And I would like to say it's quite consistent, pretty much the same. All right, so there we go. Let me talk about that as well. And the last hit will be the uh, memorabilia hit. This will go into my PC, but it's not Luis Suarez. I'm piecing this particular player because I just can't stop hitting his autograph hit. Left, right, center. And now I'll have a memorabilia hit to go along with it. Mario Goetze, 45 of 80, player-worn memorabilia, so it's not match one. That's just too bad. Momentous material jumbo relic. Alright, so this is a pretty short video. Let me end this video now. 
I'll come back later with Aficionado Soccer as well as Tops Chrome. Alright, so I'll see you then.